What's up everybody, your boy Jose Rodriguez back with another video. I look forward to this one. This is gonna be about how to become more attractive to women. Stay tuned. So the first thing that I'll say is, is this, okay? I want you to look at yourself in the mirror and ask yourself, would I want to fuck me if I was the girl of my dreams? Would I want to fuck me? And the answer would probably be no for a lot of you motherfuckers. Why? Because you're most likely out of shape. You're not competently or skillful at anything that you're doing right now. So you're just working at a dead end job. And in regards to your game and your social intelligence, you could probably use some work with that. Because when you go out, you tend to hold yourself back. You tend to not be as social. You tend to not express yourself. And that allows other people to look right past you. Not just women, but also valuable men that could be an asset to your company, could be an asset to your life. So it first points to you as the individual. Ask yourself, where are you at right now? You know, the whole pickup culture, I've been inside of a lot of these circles. I've seen a lot of the things that they've done or they do and they continue to do. And what I will say that one of the biggest mistakes that I always see from the people that I've seen and from what I've seen is that they tend to focus so much on the girl, chase the girl, talk this way to the girl, do this, do that. But they neglect how crucial and how important it is for one the individual himself, the man, to work on himself, to become the magnet that attracts the kind of woman that he wants. What does that mean? Shit. Start dressing better. Start smelling better. Start taking care of your physique, working out every single day. Get your life more organized and more structured. Is your car dirty? Clean that shit. Is your house dirty? Clean that shit. Start living your life as if you were to have a girl over every single fucking day. And the reason why I say that is because in my mind, that means, okay, what is the example that I want to represent to my woman? Who do I want to be as her man? Because this is a very important question. If you're just thinking about, oh my God, I want this girl, but you're not necessarily reverting that attention back to you and asking you, okay, but what kind of man gets with these women or attracts these women into his life? What kind of man is that? If you don't exercise your mind to think about things like that, you're never gonna get what the fuck you want, never. You'll just be mindlessly shooting at the fucking dark, hoping to get something, hoping to. It's not about hoping to get something. It's about getting what the fuck you want. If you want that woman, be able to have the confidence to walk up to her and say something. That's another thing, having confidence. But how do you develop confidence? By doing more. Start going out more to more social gatherings, to more social events where there's women and start approaching the women that you like. Start approaching the women that you find charming. Have conversations with them. It doesn't necessarily have to lead anywhere. However, just you going out and expressing yourself is going to help you step out of that shell and become a person that is willing to take action. Be that person. Because the only thing that's holding you back from being that person is yourself. Now, even beyond, not even beyond, but I would say even before socializing and doing this and doing that, or as you're going out into the world, socializing, meeting more women, networking, etc. Take care of your fucking self. Start making more money. Get your bread up, bro. <laughs> right? Start making more money. How do you start making more money? By becoming more skillful at the thing that you're doing. Whatever that is. I do real estate. I sell houses. The more houses that I sell, the more money that I make. Great. If you have a nine to five job, the reason I don't fuck with nine to five jobs is because you're so limited. Right? You can only make so much money in a certain amount of time. But that's a different conversation. But start making some more money. Right? Ask for a fucking raise. Or if you're not good enough at your job, find a job that's going to pay you more by improving or increasing your skills. 
or doing something different that you have a natural inclination of being strong at that thing, at that skill. Because perhaps you'll get paid more and you'll do better. Now you're getting more money. What do you do with that money? Well, you're gonna need a gym membership. Sign up to a gym. Start boxing. Learn how it feels to get punched in the fucking face. Because that's gonna make you feel less like a fucking loser and more like a fucking warrior. I want to go out and conquer. I'm not scared of getting punched in the fucking face. I'm not scared of going in and approaching that girl that I find attractive. I'm not scared of that shit, so I'm going to go do it. Start doing things that make you uncomfortable so that you can start becoming familiar with the feeling un of uncomfortableness and doing it anyways. That's going to develop your fucking confidence. And beyond fucking confidence, man, work on your fucking self. And it all correlates. It kind of goes back. But you start to become a better man the more that you do it. So continue to do these things that's going to improve your life. Continue to take that chance. Continue to be around other men that you see that are successful socially. And you can pick up a thing or two around them. Wow, okay. I, I noticed how he approached her. It was non-needy, asked her, asked her a neutral question, it wasn't anything that was making her feel uncomfortable, and you start to notice all these subtle things, and then you start applying these things, and your game starts getting better, however, you have to start getting better first for yourself, developing your mind, developing your body, developing your attitude towards the world, towards yourself, your self-image, your self-perception. Because who you think you are is most likely who you're going to be. So if you think you're a little bitch, when you're out in the field, you're going to be a little bitch. So start thinking of yourself as somebody who is congruent with the ideal person that gets the girl. However, the only way to be that person is to actually be that person. I don't believe in that fake it till you make it bullshit. Because it always go comes back to bite you in the fucking ass. I don't believe in that shit. I believe in make it. Make it happen. Because I can respect the man, and a woman can respect the man who's making shit happen, who's working on himself every single day, chiseling, sculpting that sculpture, being the artist of your life. High value men appreciate that, and women appreciate that. And they would find you more attractive to know that you're focused on your purpose. Because all the little boys that are out here chasing pussy, guess what? They're not getting it. However, if you're doing it right, based on the things that I'm saying on this video, you'll be more successful with women. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you think. It's a very interesting topic. I would love to hear what your opinions are and share it with you. somebody that you know will find benefit in this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Jose Rodriguez. Shout out to the BFP. Love you motherfuckers. Stay strong. Stay sharp. Peace out.